We're covering Colorado first tonight. Roads in the Denver metro area and along I-70 in the mountains are looking much better this evening. Thanks to crews working all night to clear those roads. Windblown snow and poor visibility had I-70 shut down until early this morning. I'm Joel Hill and thank you for joining us. CBS 4's Melissa Garcia has been watching the roads for us throughout the day today. She joins us live at Capitol Hill at 11th and Lincoln. So Melissa, how are the roads looking out there now? Well, snow here on city roads has melted down significantly from what we saw this morning. Uh, it was a little bit thicker then, but you know, officials say if you are heading out this evening to go to holiday gatherings or whatnot, and especially on your way home, do watch for slick spots. Work of plows and Sunday snow melt as Denver Metro Main Street's back in good condition. Snow buildup on the side streets means Christmas Eve driving may go a little slow. The back streets are really bad. I like almost slid into a curve to stop him hitting this one car. We caught up with this Denver driver filling up before heading off to her holiday plans. Grateful tonight's drive won't be like last night. I saw so many spin outs. Really? A guy hit a guardrail on the highway. Difficult driving in the metro area didn't compare to the commute through the I-70 mountain corridor. First accidents, then near blinding wind and snowfall required CDOT to shut down the interstate in both directions from Vail to Morrison around 4.30 p.m. The messy weather kept crews from reopening the route until around 12.30 Sunday morning. As snowfall moved in fast across the Denver metro area, 50 city plows pushed snow to the sides and dropped de-icer. Another round of workers continued clearing the main streets all through the night. We had another shift come in um, at midnight, so 60 drivers were working overnight. Denver Public Works Nancy Kuhn says crews are on standby for Sunday night to help with trouble spots as needed. It's still cold out there, so please be careful and use caution. Late this afternoon, CDOT issued an advisory. The National Weather Service is predicting widespread snowfall along the I-70 mountain corridor, so definitely something to watch out for. And that snowfall is expected to continue on through Monday. We're live in Denver, Melissa Garcia covering Colorado First.